so hello everyone welcome back to uh, Coyote Creek I'm doing this with a live commentary this time so we start off in a uh, area and just jump up and pull the jump switch which will open up the door there are some breakaway platforms just roll on and run off and grab the edge because this is a very high fall come over to come all the way to the right and you will reduce the amount of damage that you take just wait for this one to fall through run forward but slide down backwards here because there's a jump switch once you've grabbed the jump switch you can fall to the floor and you you can't grab a ladder anyway once you've got the jump switch. So come through here, jump and grab this. I'll go out your guns, there's going to be a dude in here. Let's see if he drops anything, it doesn't look like it. Jump over the dude. And there's a TNT barrel right here. Just pull the box out as if you know what you're doing. Oh, no, go on. I was trying to jump on top of the box, but. Never mind. There's a spanner right here. Or a wrench, as you say in America. So, yeah, we're going to grab the uh, spanner or wrench or whatever you call it. You want to come over to this and use it. I'm going to use some going to the mine car. It's not like the one in Tomb Raider 3, it's a bit different. So let's open. These doors will open and close as you come up to, come up to them. All the way to the end. And as soon as you get to the end, the a trap door opens and it can be difficult to get out. I don't know. Sometimes it doesn't. That today she's not. No, oh, I just get out. There we go. Sometimes it can be a pain to get out of this, but as you've just seen, oh, lava. Okay, so where you want to go is up the ladder. And when I want to jump and grab the switch, it will show you what it does, and it's timed. But the cutscene takes up too much time, so you have to probably leave it again. So, yes, I am going to jump at Lara. Come on now, this can be a bit of a pain, too. Oh, come on. Sometimes she doesn't grab this ladder. <laughs> this is the first time I've done live commentary in a while. So, yeah. It's much better to do it live, I think. It's much more fun. Lara, come on now. Just... Just keep jumping at this and she'll eventually grab it. However, I am going to pull the lever and quickly save. You want to do this on a roll and then jump backwards with a roll and just go for it. Nope. 
no, I didn't do that well thing. Oh well, you, you, I might be able to make it anyway. Let's try. That doing back of a roll thing does just. There we go. It doesn't matter. The thing with the rolling just makes the animation cancels out an animation. So uh, yeah. There's going to be a water rat in here. Let's just cover that. Still alive, I think. If it doesn't come out soon, I'm just gonna let it swim for a bit. That's not let it swim, and I'm gonna come back to that in a bit. So, what you wanna do is when you come up here. This guy is going to come out of nowhere. But he can't get you here. So I'm just going to stand here and let him come to me. So as soon as you come up here, it's going to come back. Just... So that's a, uh, a safe spot because he can't get to you there. But you can get him. I do exploit the safe spots sometimes. The next thing you're gonna do is gonna pull this block out. So I was just moving my chair in. And then you wanna pull it out again. So that. Oh, come on. So that you can grab the dynamite. Uh -huh. We need the dynamite because we'll use it to explode something in a little bit. And one second, I'm just going to sort something out. There we go. Sorry about that, I was just sorting out my uh, mic. So let's pull up here. And flip out. Because you can easily flip out in this level. Then you wanna grab the jump switch. Now that's gonna turn on all the uh, lanterns that are around, or which, which is important, and I will show you why. However, in one of these areas, I think it's this one. Don't help, don't kill me please. You can take him back to the uh, to the water area. This guy drops a uh, small med pack, so pick that up. Uh, you can complete most of this game without using one, but there are parts of it where you might have to, I don't know yet. But you don't have to use mode in this level, but whether we will or not is yet to be seen. So you want to take the uh, torch. Because you can light it on the lanterns, but there's only one lantern that is low enough for us to light the torch, and that's this one. So you can't light your torch on any of the other lanterns. That doesn't matter. Just come across here and light this. It's 
So that's going to make the uh, thing explode. Which is awesome. And you don't need the torch anymore, so you can just toss that. I'm going to wait for the flames to go out. Just give it a sec. There we go. You might want to crouch here. If you can't get through easily. There's going to be a few of those monks. But these monks aren't... I love how the monks from the Tomb Raider 2 gold. Tomb Raider 2 gold the Cold War level. But these ones aren't friendly. They will kill you. So we're going to kill them. I love like the ones from the Tomb Raider 2 gold. There we go. So my health is looking pretty good. I am going to save. Just because my health is looking so good right now. You know that rat is still in the water so you want to be careful. But for now... There's a few more rats in here. These rats can come in the water, I think. Come on. I know you're still alive. There you go. Just kill the rats. There's also... Don't let me... I think, yeah, there's a med pack right here, uh -huh. a large one. So, yeah, don't forget the large med is because you might want them. Okay, nothing there. So, yeah, this is me doing live calm, and it's a lot better, it's a lot more fun, and it's also a lot quicker, too. I was meant to start doing this ages ago, but I just never got round to it. So pick up this small med pack and push this block all the way forward. There we go. And grab this. We have spawned a few, uh, another one of those dudes. Oh, we took some damage today. Well, that guy doesn't normally take that much damage, but it's fine. This is not a Nomad Pack run, even though I haven't exactly used one yet. Just check that. Nope, I've not yet used a Med Pack. There's also going to be two secrets in this game. In this level. So yeah, I forgot to mention that this level is called the Working Mine. And we are going back to the abandoned mine because the previous level after this. We do need to get rid of the rat, the rat that's in the water now, so just get out your guns and wait for him. So you don't want that rat to be biting you when you make the swim. And I don't know if there's one or two rats in here, but I'm just going to save it. 
for the second rat I'm gonna just reload Lara please be nice to me today come on Lara swim through the tunnels you will be swimming back through here so it's good to get rid of the rat So we're going to do some roll and lava. Just turn around and grab this. Then jump backwards and come up to this area. This has been disastrous, but this is the first time I've done live commentary. So yeah. Can't really complain that much. First things first, come through here. You wanna use your, your dynamite and immediately jump back. Okay, it's important that you jump back and you hold it jumping back while you're placing the dynamite. Otherwise, the explosion will kill you. So yeah, just jump back from that and, you, and you'll be fine. Use the monkey bars and you're going to grab the pot. There are two feathers and two pots. And I believe this is, I don't know, but we've, uh -huh. let's pick up the part. Well, I think this is the first of the two parts. Just stand here with a dude. However, this is a safe tile that I'm standing on right now, so if you jump forward, he will come back. I'm using this safe tile. To avoid using a med pack, because this game is pretty, uh, it's pretty nice when it comes to meds, but I still just don't want to be using them willy nilly. Because I don't want to get into another Himalayan mysteries situation when I had no meds left. So yeah, we've got that and. Last thing is to come into here. And grab this part. So yes. The uh, so you've got the pots and the feathers now. And we will be going up to use them. There's a dude here, and yet again, making use of the safe tiles. But I always make use of the safe tiles. It's just what I like to do. So I jump up here. These guys can take a while if you're very uh, if you if you try it my way and save damage it can take a while. So what you wanna do is you wanna come to your inventory now and you wanna combine the feathers with the parts to create feather and part one and feather and part two. 
very uh, original name system there, guys. And I'll place your feather and part. Now, oh, please place it. Lara, I said place your feather and pot. So you go place feather one and pot one right here. So that lightning bolt is very uh, safe, it doesn't hurt you. Place the second feather and pot. And then you want to come to here and just stand. this block up here so you grab the uh, no, grab the uh, thingy my bob the totem head I should have really said that name coming So let yourself step up to the uh, tile closest to the door. This coyote dog will spawn. Jump and shoot it quite a bit. That life is looking pretty uh, good for where I'm at. There's a bit of, there's not that much more forced damage, so it's just a case of being caref being careful. Uh -huh. I pick up uh -huh. the uh, items that are right here. I think they're the rusty bolt and what are they? The rusty bolt and the trap door key. We're gonna place them both right. We're gonna place one of the items right now. And the other one was to grab the other item. So yeah. So we're gonna go and place the items and leave this area for good. So if you haven't got all the metal packs in the, in this area, go and grab them now because we're not coming back. I don't know if you can get back to this area, so yeah. However, you don't need to, so there's no point in worrying about it. If you've got the items to leave, then you can leave. So yes, yeah, so you want to place the rusty bolt. That's going to open up the door that we came in, because remember that was timed. This is a... Uh, let's climb up the ladder. And jump through the door. We're going to run back around. And we're going to grab another minecart in just a bit. I don't think this door opens again. No, you have to jump up and grab the ladder again, unfortunately. It's the only way you can get back. Come on, Lara, come on. This is a nightmare, this bit is. This is the one part of the game, but I'm really not a big fan of is this ladder because it doesn't grab it all the time. However, just oh no, I took some damage there stupidly, but never mind. The worst comes to the worst. I'll use a med. Let's place a trapdoor key. That opens up a trapdoor. If 
if you didn't guess that, then... <laughs> yeah, something wrong if you didn't think that. Didn't guess that. Let's... There's gonna be a dude right here. I almost forgot about him. Still probably not gonna need to use the med pack. We come through here. I don't know if there's any items. I thought there was something behind here, but it doesn't look like it. Never mind. No, there's nothing here. I'm just gonna run through and do this properly. I keep thinking there's something there, and there's clearly not. Oh well, just come here. You to spanner. Come through here. Now you want to slide down this. And as soon as you're down, get out. So you do want to get out of the uh, minecart. Because there's a secret, and it's just a large med, but it's definitely a secret. The time was a bit quiet, so I don't know if you heard it. But even so, it's a secret. So that is secret 13. And this is not going so well today. But like I said, this is the first time I've done live commentary instead of post. So yes, I am going to save it. It would be interesting to see what would happen because I don't know if you can climb up this without the cart. So if you left the cart up there, I don't know what to say to you. But since I see the time is a bit quiet, I am going There you go. Out here again because there is, I think, I think it's around here somewhere. Ah, oh, please be nice. There is a small med pack and a large med pack, bus secret 14. <laughs> So yes. Now oh, please just come up, good girl. So climb back up and use the minecart. You have to use the spanner every time. I don't know why she has to use the spanner every time. Don't do that. Just drive on through. Very important that you do this. See there's another door with a keyhole. So we need to grab that key now. And that one's the one that is the hardest part. There's a jump switch right here which opens up a door. Just open up the door, it's very easy to find. There's another uh, lever right here. This opens up another door. This one's not timed, so you don't have to worry about it. This one's much easier than the previous one. And to get down, there is water, but you don't want to jump into the water. It's much better just to jump and land on here. Now there are three rats in the water. I've never had them come on here before. So if it happens today, it'll be the first time it's ever happened. There you go. 
did, did I kill all of them? I don't think I killed them all, so I'm gonna come across here. Because the last thing I want is to be searching for a rat. Maybe I did kill them all, I didn't see the other one die. Yeah, I must have come into here. It doesn't matter anyway, I'll kill them. Oh, if, if it comes out, ah. Uh. If it turns out I didn't kill it, I'll kill it like a one. Let's come up here. Grab another med pack if you want that med pack. Well, we'd better if you stood up, Lara. I'm, oh no, no, I don't know what I'm doing. I've practiced this so many times yesterday and now I'm just going with forgetting everything. I'm gonna jump to here. I'll get used to doing the live calm, don't worry. Jump to here. Save the game like a uh, wimp. Whoa, I forgot about this explosion. I love the explosions, but what you want to do is when I come through here, come straight down. I like your guns. I'm going to shoot out this, that one, that window. There's also two more windows up here that I didn't shoot out. That one and that one. In this one here, I believe there's another small med pack. Here it is. I've got plenty of small med packs now, which I'm not going to be using them, hopefully. So I'm going to pull this block out. I'm not yet used to med, I'm not I'm trying to uh, keep this up, but if I have to use one, I'm not gonna reload like a wimp. I'm just gonna man up and use one. Push the block all the way forward not all the way forward, but just Just push it forward a few times. I believe it's one more. <laughs> I believe that's enough. I think. Yeah, that's enough. I've seen it glitch through the wall. So, yeah, that's. So, what you want to do now is you want to come up here, pull up, and just call on through. Pull this block out, back onto the uh, weird looking tile. There's a, a picture on the top of this block which looks exactly the same as this one that's on the floor. So that's a clue that you have to put it onto this. Let's see if I can get a uh, thing on the top. A look. See that's the exact same picture on the top as the tile that we just placed it on. I'm going to do the same thing with that one over there and the one here. So pull up this block next. I'm just gonna pull the block out a few times. Uh. Then push it all the way. Not all the way, push it forward a bit. <laughs> so, uh. I think once more. Uh. 
That's enough. And you want to go around again. You can't get anywhere from that side. You have to go beside. This is the only way to get to the uh, blocks at the side. This time you want to push it. So flip out. Press action and back to flip out in this game. So push the block forward. There we go. Then pull this block back. Is this rain ever going to stop? I don't know if you can hear the rain outside, but it's England. It's always going to rain, isn't it? So I live. Rains. If you live in England, I need a night rain, and that's a bad thing. So once you come to here, this block will raise, so you can't get out yet. The block will lower, but shoot out this. You want to pull this block out twice, and you want to pull it. You want to do something. Weird. This is a bit weird here. You want to pull this out once. And you want to push it once so you can get it all the way out. Because you can't exactly get. Because you want to be pushing it and you want to get to the pushing side of it. So you want to pull it to here, but you want to pull it back. That may seem a bit weird as to why I'm doing it this way, but trust me, it's the way you have to do it. Because you can't pull it all the way, and this is the only way you can get to the uh, right the side you have to be on to push it. So if you pull it all the way, you can't push it to the way it has to be, basically. Sounds confusing, but if you play this, you'll you'll get what I mean. So yeah, because there's no other way to get it to this tile. You want to push it. You want to push it once. And it's very important here to with, with the Winchester 73. You want to grab this. However, we spawn with some dogs. That is a lot of damage that they took off me. Oh well. Uh, grab the head. We couldn't have grabbed this before. I am going to be do something really stupid and that is to try and complete the level now without using a med or reloading a previous save because that's not how we do things around here. It might be difficult but it's definitely possible. And just for the record, usually I don't end up with a slow life. But now that we've done the business, I don't know if there's any pickups around here, but I'm not going to worry about them if there are. I think there's one over here, maybe. No, there's not. 
Well, I got most of the pickups that I know about. Considering I don't check the walkthroughs very often, I only check them for secrets. So yeah, this is as long as I get all the secrets and a lot enough pickups to complete the game, I'm not too fussed about miss a couple. Because I'm only human, I can make mistakes. I might save it. Because oh, I made that jump. Usually, I miss that jump a few times. This is only a not. There's one bit that I might get killed by, but it's not that tricky. And I pull up here. I am going to switch to the wide shot ammo. I wish I hadn't have wasted that damage earlier. Oh well, nothing I can do now. And what you want to do is you want to come to here. Use the rusty bolt. And as soon as you hear the enemies, just run up to here and run up to the other side. Because the enemies are going to come out and attack. Switch back to the pistols. Just keep killing them like this. Come. There we go. Put the guns away. And essentially now we've not used the med pack in this level and we've got through it almost. Pull out the TNT barrel. I don't think we need to use any more. We don't need to lose any more life now. There's not much left to lose. So you want to pull this out. Push it forward. This has been the best. and push it onto the tile and this is close to the end of the level now so I'm gonna cop down here oh there's a bit more that we have to do I forgot about this bit oh well I'm gonna grab out the cult. And yes, I am going to save. I am still trying to do this without using a map. No, I'm gonna reload. And the reason is because I missed some I missed this lever. There's a map I can floor, but don't grab it just yet. There's an enemy. There's another one. Once they're both dead, that's how you complete the game without using a med. And all that's left to do now is go and end the level. This is actually uh, where we started, just down there. This is where the, we, got, we got the first minecart. Well, we came out a different route. So use the key and pull this. Now this is an elevator or a lift, as we say in Britain. So yeah, this lift will rise, and yes, we've got to wait for it now. Oh, we're doing good waiting. So 
So this lip will uh, take us up to the top. In fact, I might just do some jumping for a good measure. There you go, that's some jumping for you. And now you want to come through here. And slide down this. Now, this is where the level will end. So I'm going to thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy. I'm just going to put my finger on F5 so I can just quickly do this. See you later.